Shalom guys, hope that you are doing well. Thanks for joining for a general reading. We're going to take a look at the last 24 hours, the next 24 hours, and uh, obviously the present. We're going to look at the present time as well. If you're returning, I appreciate you all so very much for being a part of this channel. Thank you so much for your energy. Those of you who are in the upright, in the earth, you are so much appreciated on my end. Thank you for being that way. Let us keep shining for uprightness. And uh, anyway, I just can't thank you enough uh, for just who you are in the earth if you are in the upright. If you're new, my name is Shannon and I'm glad to have you. And a lot of times I look at criminal activity on my channel. I don't put the spirit in a box because the spirit could never be put in a box. I'm just for the truth, the whole truth, nothing but the truth. I use all kinds of stuff in my readings, the tarot, the runes, the homemade decks, uh, just whatever. We don't need any of this for the spirit to speak, but this is how I'm used in the earth. And so um, I'm really a uh, person that is very intense at times on my channel. I could roar at energy. I hate wickedness, man. And because I look at a lot of criminal activity, sometimes it's just, oh my gosh, the spirit just comes up on me and it's just, it just gets uprooted in a very deep way. So you've been warned. You will hear information on this channel that could be very disturbing. I'm not churchy or religious. I don't have any kind of churchy mindsets or anything. I'm just for the truth, but I do keep the Ten Commandments. I love you, hold the Elohim, maker of heaven and earth. People call me the universe. I Called by a scriptural name because scripture is found in the tarot. It is honored here on my channel. Uh, I love the Mashiach, which is the Christ, the Son of the Living Elohim that walked among us in the flesh, and that is who I confess. So take it or leave it. This is who I am. Love to have you if you stay. Otherwise, thanks for checking me out. Happy birthday, happy anniversary as well. You all, I just invite your presence here, and I just ask uh, for you to show the last 24 hours, the now, and the next 24 hours. Just cut this deck for me. I would appreciate it. All right. Let's see what's going on. We have the Ace of Cups. The Knight of Pentacles. And the um, King of Pentacles here in the last 24 hours. In the now, we have the Hangman. The um, Page of Cups. Same house is coming out here. And um, the little player, the internet, we have two people here. We also see two people here with the hangman, okay? We have bosses and loyalty situ loyalty situations and um, something emotional. Or somebody's got somebody's heart in their hand or something's out here uh, around loyalty situations. In the last 24 hours, that could have been some type of secret exchanging at work with somebody for some of you all. Um, I've been getting a lot about, you know, the, the, the chariot just showed itself in another reading that I did twice in two different decks, which could be a crop cutter. So if you are dealing with somebody who lives on a farm, it comes out all the time. We are seeing like, um, a crop type of, uh, area in, so if you are, you know, dealing with somebody who lives on a farm or something like that, then there's, there's oxen there and everything else. we got a big bull here. Um, which Taurus in this deck holds that, but that energy was coming out here. You know, we've got people showing up here. And so if this is a boss or a father and there's loyalty situations around work or pregnancy or some, some something to do uh, about opening up and being receptive, then something in the last 24 hours is with that energy. And then now, you know, if that's poison and somebody's, you know, feeding somebody some poison or got somebody turned upside down because of their communication with the little page and surprising in the now what's come out of the cup, then, you know, something is here around somebody that has been hasty and has played somebody or there's a little lover type of energy here. This is seducing energy in the now. Somebody's being seduced because of something that, you know, is, is around loyalty situations and somebody's pregnant. Uh, within some matter or something might be known about that. Somebody's like, you know, really turned upside down here. This is a confusion card. It's two people are confused or somebody knows what they're doing uh, within some stupid plane in and out crazy energy. Then that's here. Let's see what else comes out here for the next 24 hours. The Seven of Pentacles. This is about somebody who's been waiting and waiting. If somebody is being shown here, taking a little bit from the tree, hold something. If somebody's a hoe, then somebody's a hoe because we have, we have seducing energy and a little lover card here. And somebody played somebody. 
okay? We got loyalty situations going on here, okay? And if that is poison in a cup and somebody's being poisoned within some situation, then we, you know, a lot of times we got something physical in the ground with a shovel, but somebody in the next 24 hours holds something up that's very physical in the ground, maybe that has already been planted there, and walking away with it, then, you know, then possibly that's what's showing here within the Seven of Pentacles. That's a waiting card, though. Uh, the truth, somebody's turning the blind eye to the truth, or something like that because of warish type of situations the falcon goes back to some type of a war um, there's pregnancy out here for somebody for some people haven't been loyal within some matter here okay secret exchanging the infinity can be found within this card and it's a physical secret exchanging i'm trying to get my balance here because why because of the truth that's known in clarity because somebody doesn't want somebody to see the truth or maybe you're dealing with somebody who does wear a patch on their eye or something like that there, there's some there's something here with clarity around something there's a lot of there's a lot of money because i've seen that card today in some combination readings it was all over the freaking place man so let's do some clarifying then show me um the last 24 hours what this boss this father this loyalty situation if somebody got bullied then somebody did. There was somebody that was uh, dealing with a cruelty situation in one of my readings today as well. Show me this uh, King of Pentacles, please, with this Knight of Pentacles and this Ace of Cups. Jehovah, what do you want to say about it, please? It's commitment situations with the Ten of Pentacles. Uh, the home. Something about a celebration. And messaging. A lot of fire is here. Cupid's little arrows are here. Uh, somebody traded something here in a very passionate way. It's just, it's just here. Show me, and it's here in the now as well. And somebody's crazy. Again, this crazy energy. You got somebody turned upside down. What do I do? Somebody trying to push a bunch of people or trying to push somebody uh, to protect something here. Uh, with the hangman, somebody's got psychedelic behaviors, and they're crossweight, and somebody does know what somebody's done, and they're acting like they don't know, okay, it's some type of a decision is here, uh, in the now, somebody's trying to, to come in and out and depart and get something turned upside down, you're a freak, man, this, you're gonna go prison, and somebody said something, knows something, somebody's trying to depart because they know that there's prison, because there's a lot of money around something, then there's some type of travel then going on here in the last 24 hours around that information okay so there's a judgment here with the um judgment card something come right up on up out of the grave in the right now something's no that's why somebody's trying to figure out what to do here from every angle somebody's a real liar here people in the now and they do know what's going on and they're just a freak man they're just crazy and th look there, there's there's truth here we had a dagger that came out today and it's here twice okay well we have sacrificing we have children sacrificing showing up here people do know about it this is the occult secret money around some stupidness and and somebody giving somebody some freaking poison at, uh, uh, blowing sunshine up their rear end and they do know what they're doing with clarity something's known show me the next 24 hours and then we had the float trip come out as well there's the boat here somebody's exchanging information with clarity about that maybe even trying to keep somebody else blinded uh from that especially if there's an investigation and there is then you know the person that thinks that they're trying to pull one over on somebody else actually it, they'll fall in their own trap because that's the word of you hold up you're dealing with the stupid crazy out here so ridiculous we don't care how big your bull is you ain't that big of a bully let your hova bully you there's there's guiltiness out here some some lying cheating babbling fool is out here i'm gonna put it back yes because somebody does know that somebody's playing somebody or they're that they know that they're playing somebody somebody's boss is here the resh is here the head the man the boss is something the king of pentacles is a boss we had the boss come out until the 5th of september for the element readings show me the next 24 hours with this truth there's pregnancy situation there's 
the, this is a fortune card as well. We have large sums of money here. Okay, we, we have a, a, an assured victory that's also going to be here. There's inheritance around some stuff. There's sexual matters going on. This is about being illuminated with something here. Okay, there's a tower. There's sexual things here. There's just big time sexual things here. In the next 24 hours, somebody taking a little bit of money to go hoe around. Okay, turn a little blind eye to something. Go get some nookie here. Okay, and somebody's boss is, is involved with either children or teenagers or somebody on the job or something like that. And this king should know better. This king should know better. If that king's in the upright, then he would know better. There's, there's something here is deceptive with the moon, the queen of cups, that person. If that's not in the upright, that's a manipulator. Somebody's being manipulated. This is I'm laying down hunting and chasing, man. Okay? And um, something's very much emotional around the home. Around the home. There's a deception here. There's the queen of wands. She also represents the other woman. Well, somebody got another... Somebody got a hoe on the side somewhere. They sure do. Yehovah, what do you want to bring out about this, please? That's going to cost you. You can obviously do what you want. You have free will. But that's if you got children, that will cost you. Let the word of the Lord stand firm. Because you'll, you'll end up hurting your own children with that stuff. People, You just will. It's not the time to be getting involved with some crazy. Um, there's a way that seems right unto man. But the end thereof is the way of death. Again, you know, in the now... Somebody acting like something's okay and it feels good and all that stuff and give me a little bit of poison here and it, it's going to kill you in the end. That's sacrifice. You're, you're sacrificing yourself, man. Uh, but you can do what you want. Um, somebody is going to have protection out here. If somebody's trying to play somebody because they know that there's a lot of money around something, if you're standing in the upright, there will be protection from the Most High. And somebody's very skilled at what they do. Again, we have a manipulator out here, people. We have somebody who's very skilled at manipulating somebody, but they're crazy to do some stupid like that, okay? And there is going to be um, protection from the most high. Somebody famous and very well known is out here today, okay? The, the Queen of Wands represents somebody who's known, okay? Um, something on the about the radio or on the radio that came out today as well. I'll read that later uh, at the end. We have an explosion, okay? Well... Is somebody just going to explode in some type of a, you know, anger? Or if that's literally an explosion. We just seen the tower. We just seen the tower, people. Uh, we, we, we know that something's happened with fires and stuff like that. We just have a lot of fire here. Fire energy is up here in the last 24 hours. Somebody communicated something about some type of a fire that's known about. And there was a, an explosion around that thing. Then I guess so. And then now somebody's just giving some type of an account. And it's surprising uh, about whatever that has been. If somebody else tried to turn their blind eye to that, then it's being shown out here. Something's very much known about something, and it's surprising whatever this is being blown up and being announced. A treachery. Yes, there is treachery out here. Somebody's been having a hard time with something. Well, I'm sure, because somebody's a freaking player. All they do is just, they just bring confusion. This is a circulation type of energy, and I'm in and I'm out of the time, and I don't know what you're talking about. I, I really don't, and, and they're a liar. We just seen the liar. Uh, you always gonna burn a witch today. Well, good because we had we had people in magic trying to put their spells on people, and that that that, that ain't gonna cut it anymore in, in Jehovah's world. It just ain't gonna cut it anymore. You will be exploded. You will be hung up. You want your little witchcrafty stuff and put your little spells and put little children in the fire. We want to see you get in the fire. We're not gonna suffer you to live and think that it's okay for you to hang up little innocent children and think that oh my God, you are so awesome because you're a freak is what you are, and Jehovah's gonna going to burn you today so let the explosion be to you all right shaking and moving and trouble and tossing well we're tossing you out um 
Yehovah has made some type of a, a union out here, but somebody's been jealous over some stupid. Something about near and local is here as well. And the field is the world, and the good seed planted are the children of the kingdom, but the tares are the children that have been sown by the enemy, which is the devil. And the harvest is the end of the world, and the reapers are the angels, and the tares are gathered together, and they're burned into the fire. Okay? And this this is what's happening in the end of the age. So uh, the fire and explosion and the burning of a witch is going to take place because Jehovah is going to make sure he gets rid of these ditches. Um, you know, the, the, the people, this goes back to, like I said, that fornication is going to get you nowhere. We've got the occult out here and that stuff's going away now. The The world is ending the way that we, we once knew it. And so if you want to go ahead and lose your children, you want to go ahead and play around, get your little rocks off, it's going to it's going to kill you in the end. It seems right to you because it feels good. And I, 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 I'm moved by my feelings, but it, it's going to kill you in the end. But you have free will and I'm not here to tell you what to do, but don't shoot the messenger because I know who my Elohim is and uh, I, I just have walked through some things in my own life and uh, I'm trying to help you but you can do what you want if you want the money go ahead enjoy it have a good time for your season at the end of it you're going to die there's treachery around somebody and this stupid crazy freak is going away now going to prison yes we're talking about crazy we're talking about somebody who needs medicine this is water this is stormy waters in the now it is because somebody's crossway because some stupidness is here all right you're dealing with people that are are, are doing nothing but freakish stuff and it ain't all right man it's just not all right this is tribulation and we are in the tribulation okay this goes back to um a spirituality and stuff like that but it ain't okay if your spirituality is hurting people it's not okay to put a little innocent person up on a tree and, and give them poison and stick a knife through them and say that you're righteous. You are a freak. You're nasty. And that kind of spirituality is unacceptable because it never once entered into Jehovah's mind for anybody to do that. You are twice dead. You will never get up and live again ever once you leave the earth because you just died when you put those children through the fire. Uh, you will meet the maker and uh, those who hate him he said I'm going to meet them face to face he's going to burn a freaking witch today and so let them go ahead and say hallelujah it's my day to explode in the fire today because you're cray cray okay so that's what you want you want to burn children then you will reap what, you, what you've done you're just not going to be mocked by you do you understand you better understand you better enjoy your little riches you little witch there's the witch right there there's the little magician that's in magic go ahead and do your little spell because it's going to backfire on you and you're going to have an explosion and we're going to celebrate uh that you are out of the earth because the children will be protected all right anyway this will come out shalom